Behold, the lawnmower. But where did it come from? Meet Edward Beard Budding, born in England in 1795. Edward grew up in Gloucestershire, and during the 1820s he began working as a machinist. This was an enviable job position. After all, working with machines can be dangerous, but it still beat the back-breaking agricultural labor of the time, such as harvesting crops or cutting lawns. Cutting lawns was especially difficult, because workers used scythes to hack at the ground. This labor-intensive task took a long time, and it also resulted in a very choppy lawn. While Edward worked at various mills, he noticed the fabric shaving machines. These devices used rotary cutters to shave the fabric down to a smooth finish, and unlike a scythe, they were able to cut continuously. In a flash of inspiration, Edward realized that shaving threads off the surface of fabric was in some ways very similar to mowing grass off of a lawn. By 1830, Edward Budding had invented the first lawnmower, not that you'd recognize it today. The world's first lawnmowers were built of cast iron, and they required two workers for difficult areas, where one person would push and the other person would pull. Edward's machine was push-powered, and it used gears to transfer the pushing power to a rotating shaft with three blades attached. By 1858, Edward had sold more than 7,000 lawnmowers.